Hello, hello. Good evening, everybody. Thank you. How are you? Everything good? Hello, teacher. Thank you. Welcome. Nice to see you one more time. It's nice to have you on this beautiful day. As you may see, we have this thing that is called our last class of this module. So you did it. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for being here on time. Okay, welcome. It's nice to have you. And I hope everybody is okay and happy and healthy at home. Good evening. Good evening, uh, Isabel. Welcome. How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Sounds good. It's nice to have you. One more time. Thank you. So thank you so much for being here, people. Let me show you what this is going to be. Um, let me see. Mm -hmm. Jesus, I have a dog barking outside the house. That's a bunch of nuts. Okay, sorry about it. Thank you so much for being here. We're going to start with this class. As you may see, we have class number 16. So today we're done with this module. Okay, so thank you so much for everything you've done so far. You did a and I encourage you to keep working like that. We're gonna finish this. We're gonna have a review on vocabulary and also on the grammar part that we have available for today. Thank you so much for being here. It's my pleasure. And let's begin with this information that we have today. The first thing we're gonna take a look in some, in some vocabulary. So I want you to listen. The vocabulary, take notes if you want. And then, then we will practice a little bit more. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for discussing school. Let's get started by listening and practicing. Classes. History, math, physical education, science, schools, college, elementary, high, junior high, places, classroom, gym, lunchroom, playground. Now, I would like for you to do a couple of things. First, I would like for you to categorize the vocabulary into three different sections. Classes, schools, and places. For example, under places you can add classroom. Then, I would like for you to ask and answer questions in the past using the vocabulary that we just learned. For example, where did you go to elementary school? What were your favorite subjects in high school? Try to make as many questions and answers as possible. After you finish this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Hi everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for discussing school. Let's get started by listening and practicing. Classes. History. Math. Physical education. Science. Schools, college, elementary, high, junior high, places, classroom, gym, lunchroom, playground. Now, I would like for you to do a couple of things. First, I would like for you to categorize the vocabulary into three different sections, classes, schools, and play. Let's work here, okay? We're gonna categorize the vocabulary. What I want you to do is like in the video, right? As you may see, I need you to write this one like this, the school days. Then you write places, schools, and classes. Write it down in your notebook, please. Write it down in your notebook, yes? In your notebook, write this, write 
the same way you see it here, right? School days, then classes, then schools, and then places. So then you can categorize this vocabulary here in these spaces, if you see, right? For example, classroom, we have it here in places. What else do we have in places? What playground. Else? Oh, we have a playground, right? So playground, you need to write it. Okay, so my recommendation is write it down in your notebook the same way you have it here. So then you can write the vocabulary according to the place it goes. Places. For example, under places, you can add classroom. Then I would like for you to ask and answer questions in the past. I'd like for you to ask and answer questions. Classroom. Then I would like for you to ask. So the idea with this one is we can work with vocabulary, right? So that's the idea, right? So you can practice and work with vocabulary. Yes. What is the vocabulary that goes here with classes? What is the vocabulary that we have here that goes with schools? And what is the vocabulary that goes with places that we have in here? So I need you to categorize that vocabulary. This is one way that you can learn uh, vocabulary by using categories, right? So to discriminate the kind of vocabulary that you have available here. And you use that according to the context, okay? So um, this is the way you can do it, okay? Okay. Have you finished this one? Yes? Yes, it's school teacher. Excuse me? It's a... Uh... Cien ciencias sería en school. Science. Oh, no, science goes with classes. Classes. No, la última ciencia. Yes, science. Uh-huh. Goes with classes. Ah, uh, yeah. Goes with classes. Oh, okay. Norma, what do you have? Tell me. What do you have, Norma? Tell me. What is what is the vocabulary that you have with classes, Norma? Rosa? Hello, Rosa. Tell me, what is the vocabulary that you have with classes? Rosa. History. Espera, ahorita. Sería este. Jim. Jim, very good. Eh, sí, sí, sí. Jim, do you think Jim goes with classes or go with places, Rosa? Jim. Jim. Is with classes. places or with classes? Classes, teacher. Um, no, I don't think so. No, class. Yes, Kim, I think goes with places. Okay, Rosa? Places. places. Kim goes with places, okay. Okay, um, Maricela, tell me, please. Thank you. With, with classes, Maricela, with classes, please. History. History, very good. Um, elementary, no sé qué, qué será. Oh, okay, no, Match. that one no, that one no, okay. Uh -huh. Math. Math, very good, math, go Match. here with glasses. Science. Science, what else? Uh, physical education. History. 
Physical education. Ah. Very good. Physical education. Very good. So we have oh, one, oh, two, oh, sure. three, and oh. four. Four goes with classes. What about with the schools? Study. College. Elementary. Elementary. Study. Lunch. College. Elementary. Lunch. Lunch. No, I'm sorry. Junior high. Junior, high. Junior, Junior high. high, yes. That is correct. So this one goes uh, here. And with places, we have a class. Physical education. Classroom. Physical education um, goes with classes. Okay. Playground. Playground, uh, very good. Playground. Gym, you mentioned very Lunch good. Lunchroom. Lunchroom is another one goes with places. Yes, very uh -huh. good. Fantastic. That is correct. Okay, so this is the vocabulary that we can relate the vocabulary according to one main uh, characteristic, right? Like classes, we have a bunch of classes. The schools, the things that goes with the schools, like elementary, junior high, uh, college, and with places, well, the vocabulary that goes related to places. Perfect, that was very good. Okay, let's continue. Give me a minute, please. Here we have some vocabulary that we were working in this, in this, um, let's say, in this section number five. Yes, we have irregular verbs and we have regular verbs. Pronunciation here is somehow difficult. Here, the difficult part is the spelling, okay, right? So write the present of the irregular verbs. What is the present of the verb age? It. Perfect, I'm sorry. It, yeah. It. What is the present of the verb but? By. By, What is the present of the verb brought? Break. Right, very good. What is the present of the verb build? Build. Perfect, build. What is the present of the verb came? Come. Come. I just come, very good. Did, what is the present? Do. Do. Do, or, or, yes, do, right, very good. What about fell? Fell. Feel. Feel. Excuse me? Feel. feel. Very good. Feel. Very good. What about got? Get. Get. Yes. Okay. Had. Have. Has. Has. Very good. Yeah. Very good. What about may? May. Make. Make, right? Thank you so much. Make. What about the verb? Net. 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 Very good. Net. What about the verb we? Red. 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 Very good. So pronunciation one more time. Red. 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 And read. Red. And read. What about road? Right. 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 Very good. That's. Sit. 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 Perfect. Sit. What about saw? See. Sleep. 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 We have slept. Very good. Slept. Sleep. Take. 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 Very good. Take. That is take. Take. Very take. good. Go. And one. Go. About go. 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 Okay, go. Very good. And write. Right. Very good. Okay, Rosa. Let's begin with you, Rosa. <coughs> Read the past and the present, please. Thank you. The past. Eight. 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 Boat. Bye. Brook. Break. Bu 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 
can come. They do. Fill, 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 fill. Go, get. Have, have. Make, make. Meet, meet, meet. Read, read. Roll, read, read. Sit, 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 sit. Say, see. Es Sleep, sleep, talk, take, when, go, grow, greet. Thank you so much. You have a few mistakes and I need you to listen. Listen the way your classmate pronounce, okay? Yes. Thank you. That's very good. What is Juan? Do we have Juan here? No? No Juan today? Okay. What about you, Miguel? Miguel, are you here in class? Yes? Hello, Miguel. Are you here? Yes or no? What's up? Let me see. Milagro. Hello, Milagro. Milagro. Hello, teacher. Did you participate? No, are you traveling? Are you traveling? I think you're traveling. Okay, I will pick another one because I, I don't I don't hear you very well. Okay. I'm I will I will select another one, uh, Milagro, because I don't I don't hear you very well. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, let me see. Hola, teacher. Sí, Hello. Tengo problemas con internet. De repente se me va por eso. No. Yes, that's that's what I'm seeing, Milagro. No problem. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Isabel, Isabel, please read the verbs, present and past. Okay. Eight, eat, bulk, buy, broke, break, build, deal, came, come, deal, do, felt, feel, got, get, have, have made make met meet read 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 wrong right thought think it so see slept sleep took take went go wrote right thank you so much that was very good can you start Fit. That fit. Okay? Very good. And here, very good, because you fix the pronunciation. Read and read in present, right? Read and then in past. In present, read. Very good. Maricela Perez, thank you. The same, please. Thank you. Yes, please. Say the verbs. Eight, eat. Eight, eat. Bowl. Buy, break, break, uh, bulk, kill, come, come, deal, do, fail, fill, go, get, have, 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 money, make, meet, mate. Read, 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 Growth, read. Thank you so much. I noticed a few mistakes, Maricela. I will say the verbs in you at home, you, Maricela, and the rest of your classmates, please repeat. So I will say the verbs and you repeat. Okay? Yes? Okay. Blanca, do you understand? Okay. So listen and repeat. Yes. Okay. So, eight, eat. But... Buy. Buy. Brock. 
So great. Build, build. Game, come. Dear, do. Felt, feel. God, get. Had, how. Made, made. Met, meet. Read, read. Road, ride. Fat, fit. Go, be. Left, sleep. Took, take. When, go. Rot, write. Okay? So this is the way we pronounce these verbs. This is the present version in red, and this in black is the past tense. Okay? So you can use these verbs to make sentences to talk about the past. Okay? So you can say, I ate pupusas, okay, yesterday. Okay? So you can say, oh, look at this one. I eat pupusas yesterday, okay? Right? This is about the past. Also, I can say, I can say, okay, uh, Maria came late yesterday. Okay? You see? Maria came late yesterday. Right? Also, I can say negative sentence, right? Maria didn't negative go to I don't know, work. Maria didn't go to work. That is negative, right? So I can say, oh, Maria didn't go to work. Yes. Also, I can say questions about the past, right? Esmeralda, how do I make a question about the past? Mm -hmm. How do I make questions about the past? Mm -hmm. Blanca Esmeralda, tell me. Una oración pasada. No, yes, question, question. Pregunta. Yes. Mm -hmm. eh, eh, pregunta. How? I have. Okay, very good. Thank you so much. That is incorrect, Blanca, and I will help you. Don't worry. We use this, okay, at the beginning. Did you go to work? Okay, did you go to work yesterday? Take a look. Right? So I use did. Did you go? Also, I can use did with whatever I want. Okay, so I can say did. I'm sorry. Did Maria. Okay. Go to supermarket. Um, wrote a letter mm -hmm. to you. Yeah. Yes. So I can yeah. say whatever I want. I can talk about you. I can talk about Maria. I can talk about Carlos. I can talk about, I don't know, whatever. And this is the way I do it with the verbs. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, a mistake. There is a mistake here. Right. Okay. Did Maria write a letter? Oh, Jesus. Also here, there is a mistake. A letter to you. Did Maria write a letter? To you? Okay. So this is the way we make questions with other verse. Okay. 
with these verbs that we have. Also, don't forget that also you can say, what did you, I'm sorry, what did you do yesterday? Okay. So you see this one? Okay. I'm going to delete this one. Okay. So, for example, if I have it, what did you do yesterday? Tell me, please. Okay. Let's begin with you. Um, See, Fatima Hernandez, tell me, what did you do yesterday? This one here. What did you do yesterday? Do you understand the question? Mm -hmm. Miguel, thank you, Miguel. Good evening. Thank you so much, Miguel. I'm sorry for you. What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? And in here, we are going to use the verbs, right? Yes. We're going to use the verbs. So, for example, Rosa, what did you do yesterday? I did, I did, Seria, right? No, I'm sorry. You need to tell me the actions, the activities I you do? did. Oh. No. You need yo, to hice, tell... yo hice que hice yo ayer. Entonces, uh -huh. que... Exactly. I was. No, you need I to use... What, what? I work until midnight. Oh, that's very good. That's very good. You need to use the verb, Rosa. This verb. I, I yes. what? This verb. I what? This verb. For example, your partner says, I worked all day. Uh, day. I worked all day. Okay. Also, you can say this one. What is this? What is this? Rosa? Um, yes, what is this? Hmm? Yes, what is this? Rosa? Oh, your mic, I'm sorry, your mic. The microphone, I'm sorry, your mic. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yes, it's, this is like, I will write a sentence, right? So you can say, I wrote a horse. Yes, so you see? I brought a house. Yes. I saw the movie. Excuse me, Jen Jennifer. I saw the movie. I saw a movie. Very good. Yes. So you can say that as well. I saw a movie. I saw a movie. What else? You can write as many sentences as you want. I ate pizza. The only thing you need to do is you need to use the verbs. That is the only thing. These verbs that you have here goes here with the question, what did you do yesterday? Okay. So to answer the question, what did you do yesterday? You need to know the meaning of these verbs. Yes. So you can communicate the things that you did. Okay? Right? Any question about this? Any question? Is it difficult, Blanca? Is it difficult? Blanca, is it difficult? Yes, un poco. That is right. How you like. <laughs> that is that is correct. It's difficult. That is correct. It's difficult. 
It's difficult, yes. It's difficult. But, but, we practice, right, Blanca? Practice, practice, practice. So don't worry about it. Just keep practicing. And with practice, we improve. The question, what did you do yesterday? Do you understand the question, Rosa? Rosa? Sí, teacher. Entiende la question, what did you do yesterday? What? what? Sí, ¿qué, ¿qué hice yo ayer? Very good. Perfect. Uh -huh. Okay. Que este, vi una película, mm -hmm. que comí pizza, que... Yes. Pero sí, es difícil, teacher. Yes. It's difficult. Para mí. No, y, y, y for, for like a, a group of people is difficult. Yes, that, that's very good. Sí. That is true. That is true. It's difficult. And you improve, Rosa, by practicing. Yeah. By practicing, practicing, right? Yes. Right? So uh, that is the way. That is the way we learn this thing, by practicing, practicing, practicing. So you say, oh, what did you do yesterday? Yesterday, I got... I'm sorry. I had a new friend. I made, I don't know, cookies for breakfast. I read a book. Uh -huh. Yeah. So everything goes in the past. And, and because it's difficult, because you have regular verse. And, Rosa, you have regular verse. Irregulars and also regular verse. So we combine the verse together. So for example, regular verse here. Yes. I will have regular verse here. Okay. Cold, cleaned, climbed, yes. cooked, decided, exercised, yes. text, invited, liked, listened, yes. loved, missed, yes. painted, yes. played, rained, relaxed, stopped, I'm sorry, shocked, yeah. stayed, studied, stopped, vacuumed, visited, walked, washed, worked. Yes, so this is the pronunciation of these ones. And also, these ones are in past tense. So, if you want to add more examples, you can say, I, okay, I painted my house. Yes. Right. What did you do yesterday? I worked all day. I rode a horse. I saw a movie. I ate pizza. I painted my house. Yes. Right. Also, you can say, yes. Um, I wrote a letter. Is correct? Exactly. I wrote a letter. I wrote a letter. That is your right. Okay. Yes. I can say I missed my English class yesterday. Oh, you can also say that. <laughs> you did? Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Sorry to hear. Yes, I think you sent a message, right? Yes, I'm sorry to hear that. Okay, so, so this is the way you can do it, to talk about the past. Yes, you can combine these verbs, regulars and irregular verbs, to communicate what you did yesterday. Okay, any question about this? Any question about this? Okay, give me a minute, please. Going to the attendance. Okay. Give me a minute. I'm sorry, I need to get your names. When you hear your name, say present or I'm here, please. Thank you. Okay. Um Aleida Areli Garcia Martinez. Thank you, Aleida. Good evening. Nice to have you. Alicia Alejandra Arieta Perez. Alicia Alejandra Arieta Perez. No. Ana Cristina Osorio Cornejo. 
Present teacher. Thank Good evening. You so much. Good evening. Ana L. Leticia García Martínez. Present teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Welcome. Nice to have you. Ana Elizabeth Campos Romero. Present teacher. Good night. Welcome. Good evening. Nice to have you. Blanca Esmeralda Mendoza Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you, Blanca. Welcome. Nice to have you. Cristian Ernesto Romero Aquino. Present teacher. Thank you, Cristian. Nice to have you. Marisela Pérez Mengíbar. Present teacher. Thank you. Alba Milagro Granados Rodríguez. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Welcome. Isabel Zúñiga de Orellana. Present teacher. Thank you. Ernesto José Arias Arias. Ernesto José Arias Arias. Okay, Isen. Fátima Saray Hernández Martínez. Hello, Fatima. No, she isn't. What about Jessica Elizabeth Romero González? Present teacher. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you. Um, Jessica Melanie Serrano. Jessica Melanie Serrano. Present teacher. Thank you. Nice to have you. Okay. Juan Carlos López Linares. Present teacher. Present Thank you, Juan, and also Melanie. That's very good. It's nice to have you, both of you. Julio Cesar Tobar. Hello, Julio. No, he isn't. What about Miguel Alejandro Rodriguez Sanchez? Present. Thank you and welcome. It's nice to have you. Nubia Daisy Ramirez de Serrano. Present, teacher. Thank you, Nubia. Rosa, hello. Present, Rosa. Present teacher. Thank you so much, Rosa Maria Salazar de Fabian. Digna Eunice Ruiz Morales. Present teacher. Wonderful. Good evening. Jennifer Damisela Flores Melendez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Nice to have you. Yolanda Yamilet Andrade de Rodas. Present. Thank you so much. Let me check the chat I'm soon really quick so then we can get into the content. One more time. Okay. Back to this one. Don't forget that this thing is not easy. So my recommendation is keep practicing with the verbs. Keep practicing with the verbs little by little. Yes, little by little. So you can ask the question to you. This one. What? What? You do. And then you try to answer this question, right? With the activities you did yesterday. Or yesterday I ate hamburger. Yesterday I bought a blouse. Yesterday I broke a window. Yesterday I built a castle. Yesterday I came late. Yeah? So that's the way you can practice little by little these verbs. Don't forget that we have Irregulars and regular verbs. So we use both of them. I'm sorry, both of them. We use both of them when it comes to communicate something in the past. Let's keep working with the next one. Okay, let me show you. Okay, so look at these questions, right? What classes did you take yesterday? What is the answer to the question? What classes did you take yesterday? Nubia, what classes did you take yesterday? This one. What classes did you take yesterday? Mm -hmm. So you need to use the past tense of take. What is the past tense of take, Nubia? Tomar. This is tomar. Yes, what the is classes. the past tense? Uh, uh... Okay, so you can say yesterday. Mm, I... Yesterday, I, I took... Uh, I my favorite class, English, yesterday. Oh, that's perfect. I love it. I love it. You made my day. You, you made my day. Very good. Yes. So, 
The question is in past. I just erased so it. So the verb is in past. Okay? They took. They took. Two. What classes did you take? English. Yesterday I took English, right? English class. Exactly, exactly. So pass, pass. What about number two? And that is for you, Melanie. What was your favorite class? What was your favorite class? And why? <laughs> um, okay. My favorite class is English. Huh? Is or was? Was English. Why? Uh -huh. Why? Because uh, is I I learn other language. Perfect. Very good. Okay. Very good. Yes. Wonderful, Melanie. Very good, Melanie. Keep working like that because you're doing it very good. Okay. Thank you. Then we have what classes didn't didn't you like and why not? Math. Oh, math. Tell me why, please. Because it's a difficult for me. Oh, that's right. That's good. That's good. Why? Yes. Math. I didn't like math because it's difficult for me. That's very good. Right? So classes you didn't like. Right? Like math. Is that was difficult for you? That's why you didn't like. Right? Then who was your best friend? Mm -hmm. Maricela Perez. Who was your best friend my best was my best friend in fatima oh, okay so my best friend what is next maricela fatima what oh. or where uh, so yeah. Where? No, I'm sorry. What? Was. Was. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Yes. So the question is, who was your best friend? Who was your best friend? My best friend was Fatima. Okay? okay. Very good. Thank you, Maricela. Then we have, who was your favorite teacher? Oh, that was easy, right? Who was mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah who was My your favorite was Mr. Palomo <laughs> beautiful beautiful you see Sería My you see? <laughs> yeah that was very good yeah. <laughs> that was very good thank you so Thanks. much that was very nice of you yes very good remember everything is in the past this one is difficult where did you spend your free time and why? Mm -hmm. This one is difficult. Where did you spend your free time? Okay. Juan Carlos? Juan Carlos, where did you spend your free time? Hmm? Christian, where did you spend your free time? What is the answer to that question? Tell me, please. Spain, no recuerdo que es, teacher. Oh, Spain is like, like, um, like spend money, right? Yes, like a star, right? Or, or like, um, pasar el tiempo. Yeah, you can use like that, okay? So where did you spend your free time? Remember it's where, so I need a place. I need a place. When? Uh-huh, very good, very good. Where did you spend your free time? Hmm? I did play with my song. Oh, 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 okay, no, I'm sorry, that is incorrect. That is incorrect. Why? Because I need a place. So you can start saying, I, what is the past tense of spend? Spend, spend. my spend. free time 
Art in any play. Art, I don't know. My Which house. One? Okay, at my house, very good. Yes, at my house. So the house is the play. Because I'm, I'm saying, I'm saying, where did you spend free time? Well, I spend my free time at my house. Or if you want, you can say it. Instead of saying at my house, you can say at home. Yeah, that's better. At home. I spend my free time at home. And then we have why. Why did you spend your free time? For example, vacation. Why did you spend your vacation at home? Mm -hmm. Yes? ¿Dónde pasaste su tiempo libre? I spend my free time at home. Because, because I relax. Oh, oh my God. Okay. Okay. Very good. Okay. I relax. You tell me. Relax a lot. Okay. okay. I spend my free time at home because I relax a lot. Yeah. It is up to you the answer, right? Also, you can say I didn't have money to go out uh, because I wanted to, I don't know, just stay at home or because I just, I don't know, wanted to be at home with my family. That is subject, right? Then we have That's the next true. one. Yes. What was a typical day of school? Oh, this one is different. What was a typical day at a school like? So here you need to tell me like a description, like the, the things that you did like during a typical day at the school. So you need to give me a like at least five, at least five verbs, five actions. This one here, okay? I'm gonna work with this one. Yes, yes. Let me see the time. Okay, okay. So um, this is one way that you can improve your English by answering questions. So you write these questions and you try to answer the questions the best way, way you can, yes. And don't forget, don't be afraid to make mistakes. Yes, don't worry about the mistakes. Si se equivoca un montón de veces, no problem. You are practicing and practicing. Don't, so don't worry. Try to do it. Figure it out. Um, I let you know, for example, English with Alema, right? Do you remember that website? Yes, on YouTube? No sé si lo vieron. Yes. Okay, yes. Para que repasen a little bit more, les voy a enviar al chat. Give me a minute so you can have it. Uh, this YouTube channel. Okay. Okay, give me a minute. This one is, just give me a minute so I can get it. Uh, in, in the chat that we have on WhatsApp, I send you the link of the channel. So you can check the channel and you recheck the grammar. The simple past videos. In that channel, look for simple past. So you can review this website or this channel is in Spanish. So you will have English y Español en el mismo video. Yes, yeah? so you can like, again, listen and practice. Remember? And don't be afraid, right? Yes, uh, I understand that this is difficult. I understand, but don't be afraid. Just keep learning, keep practicing, okay? We're gonna have a little bit more here, okay? Um, scramble the questions. For example, how was your first day of school? How do you answer this question, Maricela? 
Hello, Maricela. Question this one, number one. How was your first day, first day at the school? Mm -hmm. uh, ¿Cómo fue mi primer día de clase? Yes, very good. Okay. Um, I was... Okay, it was, very good. It was. It was. Mm -hmm. mm, beautiful. Very good. Beautiful. It was beautiful. Very good. Thank you. Beautiful. Perfect. Beautiful. Very good. So, what is the question in number two? Okay. Do you remember this question from the previous? It was. Oh, very Who good. was your favorite? Who very was good. your favorite? Who was your favorite? Very good. Favorite teacher, right? That's very good. Wonderful. And you told me already, so you don't have to answer this one because it's already done, right? That was perfect. I love it. Fantastic. Very good. What about the number three? Mm -hmm. uh, you... What, what was favorite your class? Favorite class. What was your favorite class? Okay, you told me this one also. What was your favorite class? What about the number four? So who were? Who were your best your friend? friend? Very good. Who were when your you best friend? friend? Remember, this is plural. This is plural, okay? Okay. That's why we have there, because it's plural. Yes, plural, plural, okay, very good, thank you. What about the number five? What is in number five? When you when were you to spend free time? You, 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 and and you told me right yes. your free time very good yes that is correct very good what about the number six uh when did hmm? when did live le, 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 le? no i'm sorry no when did when you, you, when did baby? you elementary high school live? No, I'm sorry. No, live elementary. Live school. elementary school. Elementary school. Very good. Elementary school. That is correct. Perfect. So this is the way we work with this one, right? Very good. Okay. So. Uh, and again, as I told you before, what do we do with practice? Until we get it. Until we get it. That is the way we are answered this. Very good. Let me show you something more here. Okay. 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 All right. Let me take, show you the following picture, right? Let's take a look of this picture, right? Yes. Take a look of this picture. Watch the picture. Watch the picture. We have Mrs. Jones, Alexis, Kate, and Jane. Okay, so watch, watch the picture. Yes. Okay, we have some trees, a bench, some grass, bushes. Here we have a bike. Yeah. Okay, very good. Mr. John, are you book? I sit down. Mr. John. Mr. John, read the book. Okay, very good. Now, here we have the question. How much do you remember from the previous question, from the previous picture? Mm -hmm. How much do you remember, right, from the previous picture? El imagen anterior, ¿cuánto remember? Yes. Mm -hmm. I remember four 
the bicycle. The bicycle. Okay. What what was okay? What is what is Mrs. Jones doing? He was reading a book. Uh, um yes. Yes. Sentada en una silla. ¿Cómo es? Sentada en una banca. Mrs. John. Oh, very good. Very good. Okay. Uh -huh. She was reading a book. That is correct. And also she was sentada, right? Class. Okay. What about Alexis? And Alexis music? Who's up? Alexis was, was listening to music. What about Kate? Alexis Kate. está sentada en, el, en la grama. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now let me show you this picture. We have Paul, Paul Adam, Matt. Laura, Adam, and Matt. Está durmiendo. Laura en la vacuum. Eh, Matt está escribiendo. Right, right. Paul. A doctor Paul, teacher. Excuse me? Paul a doctor, no. Um, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't look like a. Está ahí con. Mm -hmm. But mire, look at this one, right? It's not, it's not like a person. It's not, it's not, it's not a person. It's not a person. Oh, maybe right. Okay. Are you ready? Uh, teacher. Yes, ma'am. Maybe Paul. Um. Maybe Paul uh, repair uh, machines. Oh, very good. He repairs machines. That's right. He repairs yeah. machines. That's right, Melanie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What is that profession that repairs machines? Do you remember? No. Okay. Let's take a look. How uh, much do you remember? Sorry. How much do you remember from the previous picture? How much you remember? Teacher. Mm. Laura in the back. I not. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. And the other picture, teacher. Uh, uh, let he check in the computer your work. Okay. Yeah, it's not seen the clean. Oh, okay, okay. So she was cleaning. Or she is cleaning. She is cleaning. Okay. Mm -hmm. One more time. One more time. Okay. Okay. Very good. Very good. Let's see the next one. The next one is for all of you. Okay. So you did it. Uh, we finished with this uh, class, as you may see. Uh, thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate all your effort, all you did here in this module. Don't forget. Esto no se aprende en la noche en la mañana, right? Keep practicing. Keep practicing. It's important to equivocar mil veces. Do it. Do it. Do it. And keep doing it. Okay? Uh, practice. Uh, pregunte, right? Uh, practice the phrases at home. So don't worry about it. Just keep, keep learning because you are doing it very good. You are doing it very good. And of course, yes, we need practice. We need practice, right? But you can do it, people. Okay? So it okay. was my pleasure. Fue un placer haber estado con ustedes y compartir a little bit of the things that I know. Be nice and be kind. And Gracias, teacher. Thank you, teacher. Igual para Gracias, 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 Gracias por la paciencia. Thank you. Good night. Thank you. Take care. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Nice to meet you.
Thank you. Nice to meet you, Christian, and everybody. Nice to, nice meet, to you. meet you. My meet you pleasure. Have a, have a nice weekend. Uh -huh. Enjoy your night. Thank you. Uh -huh. <laughs>